If the world believes we can release energy, how much more we that have the source of light on the inside of us. To bring glory. Okay, so Jesus says in John chapter 2, uh, when, when he turned the water into wine, he showed forth his glory. At Lazarus' tomb, he said, did I not tell you if you would believe, you'll see the glory of God. So John 11, with miracle power, he says this is glory. Miracles is the glory of God. Okay, so God is shown in our hearts to bring about the glory. So that the excellency of the power may be shown to be of God and not of us. So this is to show power. Okay, so Moses is on the mountain in Exodus chapter 33. And he says, oh God, show me your glory. And God says, I will pass by you. And uh, I will hide you in the cleft of a rock. And when I'm past, I will take my hand away. And you'll see my glory from behind. And uh, then God started shouting out his name before him. And he said, God is good. God is merciful. Slow to anger. And quick to forgive. to forgive all right in short he is good and his mercies are everlasting and this is when he asked show me your glory show me your glory okay when he asked for the glory God said I'm merciful I'm slow to anger and I'm quick to forgive in numbers 14 God said Moses let me destroy the Israelites because they are hard headed and stiff necked and Moses said no God show your power when you spoke to me on the mountain when you said you are good and merciful and slow to anger. So when, when Moses referred to that again, he said, show your power. Okay, there he said, show me your glory. And God said this. Then when God said, I'm going to kill them, Moses referred to this as show your power. When you appeared to me on the mountain and said you are slow to anger, God says, Moses, as sure as I live, my glory shall fill all the earth. So glory is going together with miracles, signs, and wonders, of which the point number one is always healing. So God wants people to be healed. So life drive our dogs. So if I have the source of light on the inside of me, and I lay hands on the sick. So when I lay hands on the sick, I'm doing radiation. Okay, so I am bringing about radiation. I put my hand on it, bigger than laser treatment, bigger than chemotherapy, bigger than anything else, because the source in me is not the laser beam. The source in me is not chemotherapy. The source in me is the light of the Almighty God, the very life source of the Almighty Father. So if I lay hands on people, from my inside comes radiation, which is the very light source of God, which is the energy of God, which will then, if the world believes we can release energy, how much more we that have the source of light on the inside of us.